There are days when we are bright and clear. There are days when we feel down and drear. So we celebrate being here and free. And you should go home tonight and begin building your wall of me. This wall can be sturdy, intimidating, or visual. And a wall can be physical, mental, or virtual. Some walls stop, some walls keep out. Other walls speak to hope, to believe. So my call to you is to build your wall. It's called the wall of me. A wall that celebrates, not disparages. A wall that remembers, not forgets. A wall that represents your strengths, not highs. A wall that reminds each of us that we are talented, smart, funny, and living life brilliantly. This wall is entitled The Wall of Me. In this world, there are walls that meet the call. The Wall of China is the longest wall. The Berlin Wall, so tall, had to come down. The Western Wall, where others wail and their prayers abound. The Vietnam Wall remembers our soldiers that were lost. The Gum Wall in Seattle comes at a chewing cost. So when your friends, family, and foes refuse to see, look them straight in the eye and tell them to come visit your wall of me.